and out. It's been out on the bike again. Uh, watch to the end of the video, guys. It just gets better and better all the way to the end. Uh, I really enjoyed making this week's video. The reason I've interrupted you is because the sound has gone total like this, as per usual. I bought a new Bluetooth microphone and it didn't work whatsoever. So it's really nice to see you all again and it's nice to have a bit of a catch up. It feels like ages ago last time I did a, a, like a, a chat video. Don't worry, I'm not going to go on forever. But uh, I just want to give you a bit of an update of the things I've been up to and what's been going on recently. Uh, so I mentioned at the end of one of my videos just a couple of weeks ago that how can I make this bike better? And I've thought and I've, you know, I, it's not speed. I've said that so many times now. Uh, I don't think it needs to be any faster. I don't think it needs any to be any more powerful. Uh, I don't think it needs to be, you know, very much different. But one thing, I'm holding two fingers up, but one thing that I think this bike could seriously do with is a diet. It's just too heavy. The swing arm, the, the whole chassis of it, everything is just too heavy. So I've been thinking, you know, I could build an aluminium one. Uh, and I think that's where we're going to come down to. I think I'm going to end up uh, building aluminium frames similar to this. But this is my prototype, prototype one. Pro prototype two, what I'm hoping uh, to do is to sell 10 fr aluminium frames, you know, full on custom built aluminium frames. And uh, I'm hoping to sell them for about £500 each, which is a pure bargain. They are going to be custom. They are going to be made out of, you know, super strong aluminium and I personally be welding them. Uh, and if I'm going to sell you something, guys, then I want it to be absolutely spot on. And uh, <clears throat> I'll tell you how I come around doing the frame. Uh, don't worry, you know, I'm going to go on and on and on. But uh, the reason why I've decided to start doing the frames is because I've been in the e-bike world industry, whatever you want to call it now, for a few for a couple of years probably now and I'm thinking where do I actually stand with it you know obviously I could import fast wheels I could build big batteries you know I could do you know all these different things and uh, you know I do do that because I've got a, a 20s battery to come uh, so you'll see a video of us building that in the next few weeks so there is a lot of things happening uh, I could do lots of different things but because I'm a metal fabricator and because you know, I want to do a really good job and not just copy off everybody else and I don't want to be a middleman. I want to get my my hands dirty. I've said this before, if you're a long-term subscriber, you'll have heard the same before. I actually rather build the bikes than uh, ride them. I do have absolutely awesome fun out on them. I think they're absolutely brilliant uh, and I would recommend them to anybody, but I think it's a massive thing here I need to do and I need to reduce the weight in this bike and you know if you want to be part i'm only going to sell 10 of these or you know whatever i'm only going to build 10 frames uh so if you're really interested in them um you know then get in touch send us a email at uh, the ebike nut at gmail.com and uh, i'll get back to you straight away I've done loads of other stuff as well guys, but I want you to get back to this video because it is brilliant. Excuse me, is this a track back to Ellerton? Can you go to Ellerton through here? Pass some houses, yeah? yeah. Excellent, thank you. You know it is, I'm in a nice little village in North Hungary, and people are so nice about the bike. We've been talking to an old guy there and he says they want to bike.
Woohoo! This place is absolutely awesome. I thought we were just coming back out there and we're just not. We're still in the middle of nowhere. I can hear a road, so I guess we're not too far away from a road. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> hey guys, if any of you uh, haven't bought an e bike already, go and get yourself one. Honestly, go and have this type of fun. It is absolutely brilliant. Once you've bought the bike, it doesn't cost you anything. And uh, don't forget to please like and subscribe. Um, if you're interested in what's going to happen with the aluminium frames, you know, I put videos on. It's going to be once every two weeks from now on. Uh, give us a chance to put the videos together properly. Uh, but yeah, if you'd like to see what happens, see how good these frames are, and uh, see the future of the e-bike note. Of course, please, 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 please like and subscribe, and uh, boom! <laughs> see what happens next week, but I'll see you all then. Two weeks time, two, yeah, two weeks time. So press your little notification button thing as well. Don't forget, guys, don't forget. Love yous, love you, bye. Thank <laughs> you.